Today on MTG Unpacked, we're getting stuck into a nice variety of packs for patrons. So today's patrons, we have Fish Lord and Fatal Mirage. Okay, so Fatal Mirage will grab a Kamigawa Neon Dynasty and how about a Kaldheim? And then everything else here will make a huge sandwich for Fish Lord. All right. Let's get into it. Thank you for being a patron, Fatal Mirage. Any patrons get the rares, mythics, foils, and anything over a buck, along with the art cards and anything from the list. So we start off here with one of these fantastic lands. So that's a plains, yep. And a tranquil cove, covert technician. I swear that looks like a Yu-Gi-Oh card. Undercity scrounger, scrapyard steelbreaker, mnemonic sphere. Arm Guard Familiar, Mirror Shell Crab, Twin Shot Sniper, Goblin Archer, Dockside Chef, Okiba, Reckon Raid, and Rats in Leather Jackets are awesome. We've got the Nozumi Road Captain on the other side. And speaking of awesome rats, we've got a Mythic Nashi Moon Sage's Scion will whack a sleeve on him. Foil Imperial Recovery Unit. And what is the list? We are off to a great start. Let's see what we can get out of Kaldheim here. So maybe a gold span dragon would be nice. We didn't pull one in the previous video, but maybe this time we'll be lucky. So here we've got the world tree, along with a snow-filled sinkhole. Chuck that in as well. Funeral longboat, invoke the divine. Battlefield Raptor, Stalwart Valkyrie, Starnheim Corsa, Raven Wings, Raiders Carve, Colossal Plow, and Pyre of Heroes is the rare, along with Cleaving Reaper. Absolutely love that artwork. Fantastic. Foil Carfil Harbinger, and a Treasure Token. Okay, so we got a nice mythic here for Fatal Mirage. Enjoy the pools. And now. We have a huge stack of packs here for Fish Lord. Thank you for being a patron. We'll start here with Commander Legends because we're on a quest for a, let's say, a Mana Drain today. So we got a Jeweled Lotus recently, so see if we can get something else. We've got Crow of Dark Tidings, Rummaging Goblin, Deranged Assistant, Universal Solvent, Boarding Party, Omen Speaker, Palace Sentinels, Farhaven Elf, Eye Blight Massacre, Ancestral Blade, Fertilid, Path of Ancestry, Workshop Assistant, and Uncommons, Codex Shredder, Humble Defector, Confiscate, and Flamekin Herald is the rare. Also chucking the legendaries, Kedis, Emberclaw, Familiar, Galanor, Caller of Wirewood, Foil, Souls Fire, and a Golem Token. Okay, Dominaria United. Don't let us down. I keep forgetting the full tab, okay. Guardian of New Benalia. So here's our art card. Very schnaz. Along with a Plains, and these are fantastic. What is your favorite of the recent full art lands? Do you like the Kamigawa ones more or Dominaria United? Let me know. We've got Semite Herbalist, Molten Tributary, Academy Wall, Clockwork Drawbridge, Joint Exploration, Heroes Heirloom, Monstrous War Leech, and Nail Avazoa Aeronaut, so a legendary, along with Tyrannical Pit Lord is the rare, and a mythic, a Johnny Sleeper Agent, good to see you mate, we'll whack a sleeve on you as well, Foil Automatic Librarian, and what is the list, but we do get a Worm Token, that's cool as well, so we'll chuck that in. So, will we be in the Greatest Hits playlist today? We've got a good solid start here. Link in the corner in case you missed that. The Greatest Hits in Channel History. Maybe it's a bit too early to say, but I always like to mention that playlist. A lot of people don't know about it. Okay, so the art card here, we've got Angelic Quartermaster. So this is Crimson Vow. We've got a Foil Island. Along with Witch's Web, Toxic Scorpion, Massive Might, the biggest snail in the universe. 
Honored Heirloom, Vampire's Vengeance, Dread Fugue, Soul Cipher Board, Fearful Villager, and you'll notice I like to skip over the uh, double-sided cards because there's so many of them. Unholy Efficient, and Olivia's Attendance for the Rare. Foil Unholy Efficient, and Obsessive Stitcher. And uh, those vampires remind me, has anyone been watching that new series, uh, Interview with the Vampire? So we've got it recorded on our TiVo, hopefully watch it soon. Okay, we've got Mr. Orfeo the Boulder. So he's been doing a bit of digging, and or maybe he's handing a shovel to you and you're going to get to work for him. Uh, we've got a Forest, awesome. Racer's Ring, Gold Hound, Chrome Cat, a little chat. An offer you can't refuse, still over a buck. Sleep with the Fishes, Cement Shoes, Shattered Seraph, Maestro's Charm, and another Mythic, Halo Phantom. All right, we'll sleeve that up. Foil Gathering Throng, and a Magic Minigame, Booster Blitz. So I had this question the other day, which is worse, Magic Minigames or Unfinity Stickers? Leave your opinion in the comment below. I'm curious which of you think the uh, mini games are the worst. Okay, so this dude, he is somewhat familiar. So Midnight Hunt, we have Ludovic Necro Genius, along with an island. I'll chuck that in as well. Diagraph Horde, No Way Out, Path to the Festival, Festival Crasher, Flesh Taker, that's the stuff of nightmares. Human Assassin, uh, Corpse Cobble, Heirloom Mirror, Bird Admirer, and another Mythic, Eloise Nefalia Sleuth. What is up with all the Mythics today, people? And can't stay away, these curious cats. Looks like they're having a good meal there. And a Foil Sacred Fire and a Troll Card. Okay. Not good to get trolled. On to some D&D with a pool tab, apparently. That was unexpected. We've got Baleful Beholder. So anyone remember the uh, Eye of the Beholder games? In the, I'm going to say those were in the 90s. Those were awesome. Got through all three of them. Fantastic. We've got a Forest Hammer Pasha Ruin Seeker. So another legendary. Grim Bounty, Devour Intellect, Shambling Ghast, Ray of Frost, Tagna, Demon Fang, Knoll, a legendary, Loathsome Troll, yes we've been trolled, Dueling Rapier, You Happen on a Glade, and Guardian of Faith for the Rare, Foil Bag of Holding, that might be familiar with you if you play D&D, okay, Zendikar Rising, so can we get another Mythic? Looks like we've got a list pool, anyhow. So this is a Mountain. Also chuck in the awesome Swamp. We've got Scorch Rider, Blood Beckoning, Kite Sail Cleric, Pair Tactician, Fireblade Charger, Goblin Warrior, Core Blade Master, Zoff Consumption, Dauntless Survivor, Namana Skitter Sneak, and Valaka Awakening. Nice! On the other side, we have Valakut Stoneforge. I think that's a sleeve-worthy one. And a Foil Adventure Awaits. And Worn Power Stone from the list. Nice, from Urza's. Not sure if that's sleeve-worthy, but uh, I'm sure you'll let me know in the comments. And this Valakut one, I'm not sure either. There are a couple of uh, Valakut cards, so I'm not sure if that's a good one. Strixhaven. Let's go out with a bang here. Let's get into the Greatest Hits playlist, please. And this is around this way. Of course, I knew that. I was just testing you. Tendrils of Agony. We've also got a Swamp. Pest Summoning, yes. Link in the corner. Check out the Pest deck from the previous standard. That was a lot of fun. Eureka Moment. Vortex Runner. Archway Commons. Field Trip. Soothsayer Adept, Quandrix Pledge Mage, Umbral Duke, and another Mythic! Yes, Body of Research! I would say with the number of Mythics in this video, I think we are in the Greatest Hits playlist now. 
and a juress from the Mystical Archives foil Professor's Warning. Remember the Professor? Yes, I do. And a Fractal. Alright, so my favourite pull here, I'm going to say, has to be the Ajani. So if you disagree or otherwise, leave a note in the comments. Enjoy the pulls there, Fishlord. And if you want to see some more awesomeness, check out our Infinity Collector Box opening over the weekend. Link in the corner. Definitely worth checking out. Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Mm -hmm.